What's up, everybody? It's Reaper. Welcome back to Nightingale. I am in love with this game. I am. I got about 70 hours in it because I got a, another character that I'm playing, which is crazy. So, at least I learned a lot of stuff. Anyway, we're back. I know it's been a few days. Sorry. Um, So, we are in the desert picking up where we left off. And I have no umbrella yet, so I'm hot as hell. We gotta head over to Kia. Um, we have to build an estate, but oh, by the way, yeah, using my keyboard and mouse. Thank you, Inflection, because they fixed the uh, the keys. Yeah, they did. I love it. I'd much rather use my keyboard and mouse. So here we are. Um, I'm gonna grab some stuff. So yeah, really I'm already weighted down. Awesome. Oh my god. I can't wait. I feel so weak. After playing my character, I feel so weak. I, I can't even carry this stuff. Um, alright. So we're just gonna... Uh, I gotta dump some of this. Um... What am I, what's weighing me down here? Let's get rid of those. All right, there we go. All right. We're going to run our butt over there. Um, I'll just wait. I'll see you when I get there instead of making you watch. All right, we're here. We're here. The desert's really cool, but without an umbrella, it is difficult. Very difficult. Very, very difficult. All right, we got to build an estate... Karen. Karen? Yeah, Karen. Basically, that is... And I'm going to talk some a little bit like people are new, just because. Um, but that's essentially the thing that lets us build a base. Um, it lets you... It's basically your main... It marks your main home. Um, and essentially... So it marks your main home. And then you can, like, use the map to... Travel to, to your respite, which would be your estate car, Karen. Um, now, the one thing that the game doesn't tell you, and I, it's a little bit sucky. Oh, God, sorry. Sorry, Wilhelmina. Um, is that you need to build your estate, Karen, in an abeyance realm. Now, it does say that an abeyance realm, that's where I'm at now. It can be any abeyance realm, desert, forest, or swamp. And then uh, snow biomes are coming. Um, the game tells you that later. I won't spoil anything. It's really cool, though, how it tells you. But anyway. But yeah, it doesn't tell you that it needs to be in an abeyance realm. Because it, you can build one in any realm, but if it's but it won't let you fast travel to it. And you can and you can build anywhere. You can build in any realm anywhere you want. Um, but from what I've noticed, you have structure decay if you're building somewhere that isn't near your estate care so anyway let's work with the quest here um if you guys want to read this you can i've seen it so i'm not gonna go over it um but yeah we are gonna just bang out this stuff she's a reporter though now if it also if it has the uh the little like dove looking mark um that means that um it's part of the actual quest storyline all right so this is the, i'm still doing the tutorial essentially um more or less um yeah i'm not sure what that looks like in the dove i'm not sure what it is I am definitely not making my main house, my main base, in a desert, a band's realm. Um, because that's just too rough. It is very difficult. Alright, so, oh, wait, shit. She still has something to say. Hmm. 
Nelly Bly. There's a lot of like real people in this, from what I've understood. So, all right, we need a recruit. So we gotta recruit a survivor and build our estate can. Um, this is easy. We will take Maud. Sure. Um, we need to build this stuff. Sometimes you gotta step back from it. That's why I've been picking stuff up on the way over here. Except like an idiot, I didn't. I dropped my rocks. It's all right, we can grab a few quick. Not a problem. I need a pickaxe for that, which I do have. I'm gonna grab those. Yeah, you can scroll like they. The, the UI you're looking at, which I probably said in one of the other videos, they completely changed from the stress test based on feedback. So, yeah, I love it now. It works so much better. I didn't use the other one, but this one feels like it's definitely better. Stop threatening out. Big old elephant over there. All right, so we can do this. We can also rest if we need to. And then now we can recruit Maud. Maud, you are now our partner. Now, I immediately recommend doing this. My gear sucks. Maud, I'm sorry to do this to you. Take everything. They won't be naked, don't worry. Now, we want to put... Let's get out of the... Let's get in the shade here. The recruit's gear is better than ours, as you can see. So let's put that on. That. That. Um, the pack also holds more than ours. Actually, we don't even have a pack. That's a quick backpack. Uh, we'll take Maud's hat. So yeah, look at a 16. Boom. Looking good. And then we will give Maud. Maud, where'd you go? Maud. Back here. Don't worry, we're gonna give Maud our gear. Wait, did I have that the whole time? Now also, you do have to right click if you're mouse and keyboard and equip this stuff. Well, they won't be wearing it. Oh, no, I already did that. Like, just putting it in their inventory, it doesn't automatically equip it, so. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't have a hat for you. Out of the freaking sun. All right. Um. Yeah, I guess I did have that the whole damn time. I don't know where I got that nectar berry, um, but I'll take it. All right, we're going to save that. All right, and we can repair our stuff using our essence, which we have a bunch of, or 124 tier one. And we're going to see if something's still working. Oh, first we're going to grab our free essence. All right, now. Grab that. They're gonna patch this out. They actually released a statement or a, a post say, talking about it. Okay, I have, see if it still works, 148 regular essence dust. Okay, which is what you start with. Water bottles. Okay, I'm gonna buy I don't want to buy them all. I can get my hands on. Now, in case you didn't know this, to get essence dust, you basically break down items. Okay? Like right here, I can right click this plant fiber and I can get 47 essence dust, as you can see right there. But, 
You'll notice 560 dust. They did not patch it yet. The devs actually said they were going to patch it. And then told people how to do it. So I don't think they cared. Oh, we did get a charm. Which is funny that they actually described how to do it. It's not a bug. I mean, it's in the game. It's just an overpriced item item for cheap. Obviously, it's something they overlook. So now we have 568. Um, so I'm going to take a, a minute here because I want to buy everything. All this stuff, early game, cost all this. So I'm going to get enough stuff and we're going to buy it out. So I will be back. Might as well take advantage of it while it's still here. All right. It's, I've been here a little while. As you can see, I have 6,000 dust. So again, before they patch it out. All right, you can do this late game, but it's more useful early game. Um, go to an essence trader, purchase water bottles, okay? There's 10 essence a piece. Okay, then you'll have stacks. As you'll notice, when you break it, a hundred of them down, water bottles, it gives you 1,000 dust. A thousand. A thousand. I could probably edit this out. Maybe I will edit this out. I'm sorry. And, uh, yeah. So you can not you can only ever extract stuff for essence dust. Anyway, 18,000 we have now. Now we can set ourselves up hard. So, we're gonna want everything. Now it says there that I don't... This item contains... Requirements you haven't unlocked. Now, it doesn't tell you what the requirements are, but you know what I mean? Either way, we need all this stuff. So, we're going to buy that. Climbing fix. You get the point. Now, I have the crude stuff. This is all simple stuff. Which is, oh, okay. Which we don't have the ability to craft simple stuff yet because we don't have the, the workbench. So, that's more likely what that means. All right, uh, an estate address card. That is a card you can craft if you want to give it to your friends. It, it, it's, all this stuff is in the description of the card, so I won't even read it. But it lets them visit your realm, essentially. Okay, so there you go. Um, buy them all. All right. Buy everything. Seriously, why not? We're going to learn how to make all this stuff. This is way better than I started out the first time. Well, my personal playthrough, oh my god, it was rough. And we got roofs. 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 Already did that. Um, refinement, here we go. Smelter. Oh, I love it. I love this. That's why I wanted to do that now. Before they patch that out, just to get everything going. And it is popping up over there, telling me what I'm getting. You, I have chat in the chat box turned off, but, you know. Alright. Now this gives you one item at a time. Um, what I am going to buy, I think... I'm going to buy some ore. I'm going to need it. Now there, I am in the desert. Ore is not hard to get, but we'll just pick up a little bit. I'm going to throw it on my recruit because she can carry an unlimited, well, she has no weight limit, but she does have an item slot limit, so, you know. Yeah. You can hear me, I'm overweight now. Um, I'm going to buy a few regular ingots as well. Sorry if that's too loud. I don't really want to turn down. I think the volume is okay where I have it. We will need these ingots, so I might as well grab them. We'll save time in the long run. I may do this again with the, uh, the essence off camera. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Um, yeah, we'll buy some scraps. 
Trust me when I say having this stuff is going to save me time, which is why I did this. We're going to buy some hide. And we're going to buy some paper. I do, they need to change this UI though, so when you're like, it doesn't pop up all the time, back, like, go back, like when I click it, it, see how it does that. Now you can still keep buying, as long as it tells you what you're on here. Find some ink, which I don't think that gives you one, I think that gives you stacks. Um, I'm gonna buy a few seeds. I don't think I need them, but whatever. All right, so, Maud, I really need you to hold a bunch of stuff. No, paper was just individual, so that's fine. All right, so. We're gonna get Maud to hold our stuff. Good. Yeah, we're underweight. Okay. Now we got to build our estate care, which is there. We need rocks, which I just gave Maud. I do have 20. Um, as far as the where I want to build it. Pickaxe work. If you see those damage numbers, the ones that are like going down, just know that you're not doing the damage you should be. Also, I'm going to put my umbrella up. Yeah, if you see white numbers, you're doing fine. Also, I've noticed when I run up to something and hit it, it like does it faster, so. All right, um, I do have to do this place, so I guess I'm just gonna build it here. Not a lot of trees around, um, it sucks, but some items in the world you can break down, so don't be fooled and thinking you can't. Some of them you can. Picking these up for a specific reason, you'll see. All right, um. I'm gonna build it right here because I have to do this tower. So, the hell with it. We're just gonna put together a tiny little house right here. There we go. Here's Puck. Your tenacity overrules the gusts of fate. I'll let it run in case and you wanna hear it. Fay, you have pleased. Settled here. You'll soon wish to venture farther, the unending lure humankind so often succumbs to. Should you hear that siren call, you'll require unbraided cards and the power to play them. Fortunately, both are close at hand. And here is the knowledge that Robin's friendship affords. Across this realm lie sights of power sealed by your kin long ago. Forsworn by Fay, even longer still, there are many sights, each granting access to ever more distant spheres. 
Nearest, though, the antiquarian. Formidable enough for one so green. You must first gain entry. Passing through a seal forged by those last children of Earth, who claimed reverence for our infinite wisdom. They, more than most, knew the gravity of a contract. Their gates bar access to those unworthy, but I see that strange, hopeful spark within you. Nurture it with its own fundament, humanity. Be it comfort, companionship, coffer, I know not. Once within, delve ever deeper. Toward the pedestal. Upon it lies the means to craft the card you require. Hurry now, fleshling, and prepare. The infinite awaits. I love the voice acting for fuck great. I'm just going to call that home for now. How far you've come, and yet how little. Across these wilds, your kind right, have I'm proliferated. That was nothing major. All right. We got to go in there. You do require a gear score of 20. We have 11. This is basically, which is weird that it's 11. It does go by your... Your weapons too, so probably why. But all right, let's get a little house done. Just a basic. Um, yeah. Believe it or not, it's cheaper to build stone, like a crude foundation, than a crude wood foundation. I don't know why that requires so much. Weird. Um, so let's go gather some stone. Let's do that. The recruit will do this too. And also, and this, I see so many people make this mistake. Oh, now I do have my keys rebound, but nonetheless, hold down the interact button not when you... You can't do that, idiot. What are you doing? Like, now not there, but watch. That I have to collect. But if I break this, there's a whole bunch of them laying on the ground. Hold down the yeah, bu button and it will pick up everything. And quite frankly, in a pretty good radius around you. In fact, I'll show you. I'm way up here. Watch. Didn't get that one, but you can you get my point. She picked it up. Maud, I got more for you. Now you can just stick everything on your recruit, because she will help you build. See, I'm just holding the button now. I have literally watched so many YouTubers not do that. It's insane. It just like drives me nuts to watch and see the see if I make that mistake, because it says it. Maud, I need you. Get back here. Come here. Oh my god, click the button. Um, they do need to move the location of the dismiss recruit. Now, I can dismiss her and then immediately re-recruit her. She still has all my stuff on her, but I've done it by accident. It's kind of a pain. Um, so yeah, they need to move that. Or, or at least, I don't know, change how it functions. Something. Something. That's all I'm saying. I tried breaking that one earlier and couldn't. What am I doing? I'm gonna grab some wood. Thank you, Maud. Appreciate the help. God, I feel so weak. Because I am. Maud. Maud, help me. Tree. Please hit the tree. What is she doing? Oh. That's a big ass tree, for real. 
By the way, that will hurt you and break your structures if it falls on your head. So just know that. Yeah, but and they are working on follower or on the recruits. They said, so. Um, they and you can change their weapons, obviously, but they can't shoot guns right now or bow or the bow. So, but yeah. I gotta get a little place down to make some better gear. Um, now, it doesn't show your radius for... Oh, what was I doing? Yeah, and I don't have the ability to make this, but she does, so I can still do that, and I can still place it. And she should build it. If I want to, I can build right in there, right in with them. Like, that's what's great about it. Maud, help me out here. Like I said, we're, we're just going to throw basic stuff up. Um. There it is. Door. I said door. Might be out of stuff. Nope, not what I wanted. Now we'll just do that one. That one. All right. Now, need a roof. Make sure you actually use the roof. Crude flat roof. We want the crude. No. No. Um, I guess that, that is what I'm going to have to use. Alright, there we go. Got our first little house down. It's not done, but it's down. So. I need a campfire. I will stick that right in the middle of the room. Now everything connects, like there's augmentations, all that stuff, you'll understand. Um, so we need the workbench. See that little green line? That means that it's gonna have recipes attached to it. Don't have everything for that, so I'm just gonna get a few basics down. Um, Because I'm not living in a desert row. Not doing it. Not doing it. It's too rough. Um, I will put a smelter down. some storage I'm just gonna stick these like that um don't have any animal fiber right now Um, I think they have some for sale, though. Oh, I don't need sticks, dang it. But, yeah. Um, where's my torch? There you go. Um, I am going to call that one there. I'm going to work on the base a little bit. Craft a few items 
and do some grinding a little bit off camera and I will pick back up F4 to get, over, get rid of the HUD and uh, I will see you in the next one. I love this game. It's amazing. Uh, take it easy.